mean to be tongue-tied? Well, my son was actually born with a tongue tie, and what that is is when there's a flap of tissue below your tongue, it makes it so that your tongue does not have free range of motion, and it's basically tied down to the floor of the mouth. When he was born, I saw this right away, and I was concerned and for, the, for various reasons. First, I was concerned about nursing, and that proved difficult, which is why I chose to get a phrenectomy for my child. But secondly, some people make it past nursing just fine, but the next thing we talk about and consider is speech, because when your tongue cannot move freely within your mouth, there's certain words that are difficult to pronounce. The third thing that I discuss with parents about when they're considering to do a phrenectomy is oral cleansability. What that means is when after we eat something, we actually take our tongue and move it around our mouth in order to cleanse around those back molars while we're right after we eat, usually we're rinsing with some water at the same time and most people are able to do this, but when your tongue is tied to the floor of your mouth, you actually aren't able to completely cleanse your mouth and therefore can get food impacted around the backs of your molars and it makes it more likely for cavities. So these are the things that I discuss with my patients when considering whether or not we want to do a phrenectomy to release the tongue if your child has a tongue tie.